Here's a basic pick and place routine done in DuBot Studio where we have it go home, pick up an object, drop it off somewhere, and then go home again. Let's kick it up a notch and use an input to make this thing start when we click a switch, a digital normally open switch. So to do this, we have to make sure we're in pro mode. So we're going to click on the slider, change it over to pro. You'll notice you get some more steps up here. But the key is that you get all this good stuff over here. And what I want to do now is I want to add an input as a trigger on the first line of code for the home position. So when it runs the first line of code, it'll wait for that trigger. So I've plugged my switch into input number 5. If I click on that and I set it equal to 1, and say add, you'll see that on my first line of code in the first line up here, it ends up adding this, these three columns. Trigger, what trigger is it, what the condition is, and what the value is. So now when I run this, when I hit the start button, it won't play my program until I hit the switch. 